Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss in brief about the municipal water treatment which is suitable for the purification of water for domestic use. It involves two steps. One is the removal of suspended impurities and the second step involves the removal of pathogenic microorganism. So, coming to the removal of suspended impurities from the water, again it involves four steps. The first step is screening and in this method water is allowed to pass through the screens containing big holes. Then the floating impurities like wood, leaves, plastic can be removed from the water. The second step involves sedimentation. In this process, water is allowed to stand undisturbed in big water tanks. Then the suspended impurities will be removed from the water. Third step involves coagulation. In this method, the colloidal impurities can be removed from the water whenever water is treated with coagulum such as sodium aluminate or alum. So, for example, when water is treated with sodium aluminate, then it results in the formation of aluminum hydroxide which is a gelatinous precipitate and it tra traps all types of colloidal impurities and thus they can be removed from the water. The fourth step involves filtration. In this method, colloidal matter and microorganism can be removed from the water whenever the water is passed through the sand filters. The sand filters consist of three layers. One is the fine sand layer, second one is the coarse sand layer, third one is the gravel layer. So, whenever the water is slowly passed through the fine sand layer, almost colloidal impurities and microorganism can be retained in the first layer and then slowly the water will percolate along the coarse sand and gravel sand. Finally, the filtered water will be obtained. Second step involves the removal of microorganism from the water and that can be done by disinfection or by sterilization methods. Sterilization method means it is the process of killing the microorganism. Several methods are available for the disinfection or sterilization. So, initially let us discuss about the chlorination methods. That means here the chlorine is the active reagent. So, initially coming to the chlorination method, the chlorine is added to the water. Then it results in the formation of hypochlorous acid. It is the actual disinfecting chemical. So, this chemical attacks the bacteria and thus bacteria will be killed. Coming to the second method, it is called as chloramine method. The chemical formula of chloramine is ClNH2. It is not readily available, so it should be prepared. So, it can be prepared by treating chlorine with ammonia. Then, this chloramine, whenever it is added to the water, again it results in the formation of hypochlorous acid and thus the bacteria will be killed. Coming to the third method, it is called as bleaching powder method. So, in this method, the bleaching powder is added to the water. So, the chemical formula of bleaching powder is calcium oxychloride that is CaOCl2. So, whenever bleaching powder is added to water, it results in the formation of chlorine. That chlorine reacts with water and again results in the formation of hypochlorous acid and thus the bacteria will be killed. In general, if excess of bleaching powder is added to the water, it gives undesirable smell, disagreeable smell to the water. So, especially 1 kg of bleaching powder can be added to the 10 power 6 liters of water. These are the chlorination methods. Moving to the other methods, disinfection or sterilization can be done by the addition of ozone. So, whenever ozone is added to the water, initially it is being unstable, dissociates into water and nascent oxygen. 
this nascent oxygen is the actual disinfectant chemical so this nascent oxygen reacts with bacteria and thus the bacteria will be killed or simply the disinfection can be done by boiling so whenever water is boiled for about 10 to 15 minutes then the existing microorganism will be killed in this way municipal water can be treated if you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day